Hello, welcome back. It's Saturday, so I spent uh, many days, the last five, last week, I spent to download a lot of PDF about uh, small ultralight, <coughs> ultralight aircrafts. Um, I made like 100 videos about it in my language tennis. So I'm a little tired, but I like to continue reading about all these fighter jets. Not just uh, the Russians. I'm not going just to read about the old uh, Russians MiG fighter jet and the Sukhoi and stuff. But we have this war going on in Ukraine. So uh, and I don't like just to read about all the Amer old American fighter jets the last next half year or next year. So I have, I'd like to read about some of the Russian <coughs> uh, fighter olds from the Soviet Union. If I not do it now, I will maybe never do it. So my apartment is a little bit hot today again. No, it's not really hot, but it's a lot of uh, water. It's a lot of water in the air, it's very moist. Like a greenhouse, there's a lot of water in the air, so the air feels very hot because there's so much water in the air. Uploading I just this was so, uh, so I made a many 100 videos about ultralight. I have it all here, all these many papers. Now I got 20 papers. I have 20 papers with ultralight I have with one hand. So all the fighter jets is below here somewhere, but I'll do with this later. Now this one uh, have a paper clips going into my papers. So uh, I need maybe 19. Uh, 19 pages, all kind of ultralights. All this I have uh, downloads. All this whole different kind of Rotax agents. That's page 17, 18. So I did download all this and made video about it. Then that's just going on forever. And we have to go down to. Think do is like that, but I'll look at this later, I'd just like to continue. So the page 13 is uh, a little bit ultralight. That's from page... Yes, this is uh, normal aircraft. All this uh, Yakulev Russians, so we have to get many pages back. But this is a, a Chinese uh, MiG-21 not important at all, but uh, I like to read it, because if I not just do it, I will never do it. No, uh, it's part of the history, uh, the fighter jet history. China makes uh, many copies of the Russians' design back in old days, but I think they still do that. China get some uh, technology from Russia to build uh, fighter jets. Of course, many of the Chinese, but I'm not. Uh, I'm not read uh, any of the Chinese fighter jets. This is what I'm trying to do. I like to read some of the Chinese uh, fighter jet too, and the Russian, not just the American one. I'm not going to spend uh, one year just to read about. Many hundred old American fighter jets. I like to read about the Chinese too, and the Russian, and from the Soviet Union. I need to put this to be the public. Now the sun is shining, so now the temperature will get up and up and up, up to like 30 degrees. I do two, do like this. Like uh, one hour, 
just the sun shining a bit like half an hour. The temperature will get up a lot in my apartment. It's quite so hot that I always let's put the video public. So uh, I like Minecraft and aviation, but I'm soon age 60 and did not have a good life the last 20 years. And I have this problem with my debt. Every month I uh, need money because I have this credit card debt. I have to pay like thousand dollars. A little bit below thousand dollars to my uh, credit card debt and tax debt. And my body weight is getting up. I just get up 1.6 kilos yesterday. My body weight is getting up and up and up. But my get debt is going down. And I'm just in the end of a long month. It's Saturday 26. Still have many days. I'll get my pension Thursday. So that's a long time, Thursday morning and Friday I have to pay everything again. I have to pay my rent and if I do that I will uh, end up homeless in uh, Copenhagen close to here. I will end up um, homeless in Copenhagen with an old uh, backpack, this old backpack. Can be nothing inside here. I have a sleeping bag inside. So I need to be a little careful with my money because I have this low pension and I have this debt. I'm still try. I have not give up trying to pay my debt down. I just need a few more months because every month my debt now is three thousand three hundred Danish kroners these two credit cards so every month I will get like 10 or 15 dollars this payment but I have other credit I have other this pay this credit card not not dropping the payment uh, this credit card is just the same every month to it's going to zero so the only way I can get a little more money every month is that's to stop spending money these two credit cards. My payment will uh, get down. I need to spend another $130, dollars My hard drive is full. My external hard drive is full again. So every month I have to buy like 4,000 gigabytes. 5,000 gigabytes or 4,000. This is a 4000. I have to buy one of this like every month because I'm making so much video. So, this is not uh, important at all. I just like to read about some Russian fighter jets and Chinese. I don't like just to read about all uh, the old American fighter jets. I will do that later, but I'm, I like to do it. And next, I will read the uh, MiG, MiG uh, 19 and MiG 17, 15, and MiG uh, 9. Then I need to read about the MiG 27 and the MiG 35. I need I need to go upwards. I don't need to do it, but I like to do it. If I not do it now, I will uh, never do it. I will never read about it, so we do it uh, now. There's many 
this mini haunted old American uh, from the United States mini haunted old old jets but I don't like just to read about all this so let's I like to read this and after this I will read the, the MiG-19 uh, MiG Chengdu J7 J7 forward slash F7 air gear day bath foot 7B in flight roll fighter aircraft manufacturer Chengdu Aircraft Corporation forward slash Gids How Aircraft Industry Corporation first flight 17 January 1966 status operational primary users People's Liberation Army Air Force, China Bangladesh Air Force, Korean People's Air Force, Pakistan Air Force produced 1965 2013 number build 2,400 plus developed from Ikoyangavik MiG 21 developed into Gitzhao JL 9. The Chengdu J 7, Chinese 7, third generation export version F 7, NATO reporting name Fish Can 1, is a People's Republic of China fighter aircraft. It is Allison's built version of the Soviet Mikoyangovic MiG-21, and thus shares many similarities with the MiG-21.2. The aircraft is armed with short-range infrared homing air-to-air -air missiles and mainly designed for short-range air-to-air combat. The aircraft is also used for close air support. On the 30th of March 1962. The Soviet Union and China signed our technology transference arrangement pertaining to Themig-21. Allegedly, while various kits, components completed aircraft and associated documents were delivered to the Shenyang Aircraft Factory, the design documentation was incomplete, and Chinese designers made efforts to reverse engineer the aircraft. While the two aircraft are greatly similar, Areas of difference include the hydraulic systems and internal fuel arrangements. During March 1964, domestic production of the J-7 reportedly commenced at the Xinyang Aircraft Factory, but due to various factors including the Cultural Revolution, mass production was only truly achieved during the 1980s. Numerous models of the J-7 were developed, Feature range improvements in areas such as the armament, avionics and wing design. The aircraft is principally operated by the People's Liberation Army Air Force, PLAF, but numerous international operators have bought their own J-7S. Outside of China, the largest operator of the J-7 is the Pakistan Air Force. Later generation Chinese aircraft such as the Xinyang J-8 Interceptor, were developed with the lessons learned from the J-7 program. Several nations, including Zimbabwe, Tanzania, and Sri Lanka, deployed the type in offensive roles. In 2013, production of the J-7 was terminated after the delivery of 16 F-7 BGI to the Bangladesh Air Force. Newer fighter aircraft such as the JF-17 Thunder Multi-Role Fighter, have succeeded it in the export market. To date, large numbers of J-7S remain in service with multiple export customers. 3, 4, with Plave set to retire the fleet in 2023. 5, Design and Development. Background. In the 1950s and early 1960s, the Soviet Union shared a large proportion of its conventional weapons technology with its neighbor, the People's Republic of China. One such example is the MiG-19, which was locally produced by China as the Xinyang J-6 from as early as 1958.6. During the same decade, the even more capable MiG-21 had been developed by the Soviets. This fighter, being inexpensive but fast, 
Knights suited their strategy of forming large groups of people's fighters to overcome the technological advantages of Western aircraft. However, the Sino-Soviet split abruptly ended initial cooperation efforts. Between the 28th of July 1928 and 1 September 1960, the Soviet Union withdrew its advisors from China resulting in the J-7 project coming to halt in China. During February 1962, Soviet Premier Nikita Khrushchev unexpectedly wrote to Mao Zedong to inform him that the Soviet Union was willing to transfer MiG-21 technology to China, and he asked the Chinese to promptly send their representatives to the Soviet Union to discuss arrangements. The Chinese viewed this offer as a Soviet gesture to make peace, while suspicious, they were nonetheless eager to take up the Soviet offer of an aircraft deal. A delegation headed by General Liu Yala, the commander-in-chief of the People's Liberation Army Air Force, PLAF, and himself a Soviet military academy graduate, was dispatched to Moscow immediately. The Chinese delegation was given three days to visit the MiG-21S production facility, which was previously off-limits to foreigners. 7. The visit's authorization was personally given by Nikki. Yes, let's uh, read from the top again. Of course, I was thinking on uh, something else. I had to think about this, I'm reading this. No, I was laying in my bed and thinking of all kind of other stuff. You cannot do that because I like to read it. I'm not just do this just to record on video. I like to read it myself. Chengdu J7. J7 forward slash F7 air cured a BAF foot 7B in flight roll fighter aircraft manufacturer Kengdu Aircraft Corporation forward slash Gits How Aircraft Industry Corporation first flight 17 January 1966 status operational primary users People's Liberation Army Air Force, China. Bangladesh Air Force, Korean People's Air Force, Pakistan Air Force produced 1965-2013 number build 2,400 plus developed from Ikoyangovic MiG-21 developed into Gitzhao JL-9. The Chengdu J-7, Chinese, 7, third generation export version F-7, NATO reporting name, Fish Can, 1, is a People's Republic of China fighter aircraft. It is Allison's built version of the Soviet Mikoyangovic MiG-21, and thus shares many similarities with the MiG-21.2. The aircraft is armed with short-range infrared homing air-to-air -air missiles and mainly designed for short-range air-to-air combat. The aircraft is also used for close air support. On 30 March 1962, the Soviet Union and China signed a technology transference arrangement pertaining to Themig-21. Allegedly, while various kits, components completed aircraft and associated documents were delivered to the Xinyang Aircraft Factory, the design documentation was incomplete, and Chinese designers made efforts to reverse engineer the aircraft. While the two aircraft are greatly similar, Areas of difference include the hydraulic systems and internal fuel arrangements. During March 1964, domestic production of the J-7 reportedly commenced at the Xinyang Aircraft Factory, but due to various factors including the Cultural Revolution, mass production was only truly achieved during the 1980s. Numerous models of the J-7 were developed feature range improvements in areas such as the armament, avionics and wing design. The aircraft is principally operated by the People's Liberation Army Air Force, PLAF, but numerous international operators have bought their own J7S. Outside of China, the largest operator of the J7 is the Pakistan Air Force. Later generation Chinese aircraft such as the Xinyang J8 Interceptor were developed with the lessons learned from the J-7 program. Several nations, including Zimbabwe, Tanzania, and Sri Lanka, deployed the type in offensive roles.
In 2013, production of the J7 was terminated after the delivery of 16 F7 BGI to the Bangladesh Air Force. Newer fighter aircraft, such as the